everyone and welcome to In The Kitchen With Pen and I'm doing our first roast dinner in the Ninja 10 in 1 today. So the dinner, it is roast pork, we're having it with roast potatoes which will be cooked in the 10 in 1 as well and we're having cauliflower, carrots and green beans which I will cook in the 15 in 1. But let's just bring you down and show you the roast pork. <clears throat> Actually, I should have said the unroast pork. This is a pork shoulder joint from Sainsbury's, which has been seasoned with sea salt and black pepper. And it's on the trivet that comes with the 10 in 1 and also obviously on the baking tray so that any juices and fats sit onto the tray rather than falling onto the um, oven itself. So I'm just going to bring you over a little bit more and show you the oven. Okay, so we are going to need to switch it on and we are going to roast and as I said to you it's a whole roast which is a whole joint and we're going to roast it says 190 it says level one um, and it says 45 minutes well I have I don't know if you noticed the meter probe in there and we've got it connected so that we know exactly when it is cooked but I'm still going to increase that time to one hour I'll press start we will have our 90 second preheat and then we shall go in the oven right time is up as in heating preheating time so let's get this Put in, as I said, on level one and shut the door and away we go. We will be back to see what this looks like when the time is up. Well, I'll be back before that actually because I will be putting in our roast potatoes. minutes or so left on the cook of the pork so I'm now going to add the roast pota potatoes for roasting. I have parboiled, I have tossed in a little oil and salt and pepper and now I'm going to put them in on the trivet with the meat so come on down and look. Right so first I'll need to open. Wow, wow, wow. That is looking pretty darn good, even if I do say so myself. Let's move you out so you can have a look at it too. And I've got the potatoes, and as I say, they've been parboiled, they've been tossed in oil with salt and pepper. And now I'm just sitting them onto the trivet with the pork. And once the pork is cooked, I can take it out and the potatoes will carry on cooking. So, they're all there. Got some more oil in there, which I can just brush over the tops of the potatoes whilst they cook. back on because obviously that's blooming out and I'm so daft I was likely to try and pick it up without so I'm going to turn it round as well and there we go I'm also 
also going to increase the time and we're going to go for about 30 minutes for the potatoes there you go and that's it so um there's our homemade stuffing which i will put in in about 20 minutes computer set timer 20 minutes 20 minutes starting now there we go we'll be back when we serve right according to the meter our meat is cooked so let's get it out i have to say it does look pretty darn good and it smells even better so put your gloves on and there you go does that not look good Little kitchen. And of course, what do I keep doing? Adding to it, don't I? And not in space, just with um, gadgets. Alright. Let's take this. Oops. Eventually, this is a lovely piece of meat. And once they're out, I shall turn the potatoes. And they're looking good. They're looking very nice. In fact, oh yeah. And I will also pop the stuffing on the tray. In the oven that little lot go right and I'm just gonna pop the uh, ninja pressure cooker on now the 15 in one so make sure that I'm my valve is set to seal Stop, it's just about to set the timer off. Computer, computer, stop. There you go, she stopped. Right, computer, stop. Right, listen. So we know we've got some crackling there. So we should just let that rest. These cook and uh, should we try and. Back when I dish up. Right, dinner is served. Roast pork, lovely crackling, roast potatoes, vegetables, and homemade stuffing. I've poured some gravy onto mine. 
and I'm just about to take Steve's through and then of course we'll have the taste. Well then, are we ready for this? Let's see how well the Ninja can in one oven cooked a pork joint. I know, it's lovely, but you know, let's, let's be fair. So, piece of pork. Tried to get some that had no gravy on, and it's not an end piece. And it's beautifully moist, it's got flavour, <coughs> it's lovely. Crackling. That's got a crackle, isn't it? Mm. Oh yeah. Now let's taste the stuffing. Try not to drop it everywhere, Pen. Mm. Buttery, well seasoned. You get all the um sage and oh that's really nice i should have made more and finally the roast potato now that has a nice crunchy outside and a smooth smooth fluffy middle doing is I'm just wiping down the oven door um, and as I said to you yesterday the day before whenever I'm leaving the door open so that any splashes don't bake on but I think this 10 in 1 oven is going to be an absolute boom now the other thing I know we notice I we notice using the meter it gives you the ambient temperature of the oven as well as the temperature of your meat and I had this at 190 and it was around 189 so I know for a fact that the oven is true to temperature which wasn't happening with my big oven but anyway, I'm going off to enjoy my dinner. Um, Ninja Tony in one oven, roast dinner. It's a winner from me. So thanks for watching and I'll see you again very soon in the kitchen with Pen. Bye bye. Okay, the mister's here to tell you all how difficult it was to use this oven, how well he cooked the dinner and maybe even if it tasted good. Who knows? Well, let's start on oh, the bit. <laughs> the seasoned meat. <clears throat> if you want your meat seasoned, I'm your man. I think you should hire me out. I'm not people sure how much I'd make. Well, well you know what I mean? People want to eat proper, they need to invite Dr. Season round. They want to eat proper. Um, to be honest, it's the first time you've used it. For a proper cook? For, for a Absolutely. proper cook. Um, actually, it was very good. It was very good. And the meal, I enjoyed it. And not only that, the carrots were cooked. Nothing to do with that, but gradual training has come through. Edible, <laughs> edible carrots. Um... Forget the carrots, we are talking about oh, right. the, well, the, no, I'm the talking Ninja about the, 10 in 1 the oven. In general, to be honest. Excellent. I know it was £279. I know some of you feel that uh, it's unnecessary since we have the oven, the big oven. And we've had comments about the fact that this is going to take a long time to pay back what that would use. 
But do you know what? We don't care. We're doing a channel. We buy these things, test them for you. Do so, I buy them too? Yeah, well, <laughs> I mean, we didn't. They won't be here. But we buy them. We are we are becoming a better channel. People are beginning to trust us. Companies are making contact. And you never know. Watch your telly. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Um, so it's very good. It's I will do a noise test next time Penn's doing. So because people have complained about the noise. To be honest, I measured it yesterday and it was no louder than so Rude. What can I say? Right, whilst we're here, um cleaning. Cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. <laughs> yeah, look at him backing away. Um, yeah, I can see some marks on the oven, but I've cooked a pork joint. Let's take you and show you. I am going to exit stage left and uh, hopefully see you all very soon. Going to do some reviews. Um, I've actually been requested, so uh, that's all very nice. And as per usual, keep cooking. Okay, look, let's take you in. So these are getting a little bit marked, but what I really wanted to show you, if I can, let's take this out, is, there you go. Right, now, what I'm gonna do is I'm now going to spray that with some fairy max power spray so stay there we'll see We are switched off at the mains, so let's spray some fairy, fairy power spray. Leave it to do its work. I'll do the washing up and we'll be back. Thank you for watching this edition of In The Kitchen <laughs> with Pen and sometimes Steve. If you'd like to see more of our cooking and review videos, then click here. But if you'd really like to help the channel grow and subscribe, please click here. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye bye. Oh, yes. Keep cooking. Right, send that to me.